What's up guys, welcome to my channel. I am back with another new video. In this video, I will tell you about Oppo Reno5 and Oppo Reno5 Pro. But before starting, let me know down in the comment section on which phone are you watching my video right now. Oppo Reno4 and Oppo Reno4 Pro came out in June. Reno4 Special Edition joined them in September and Reno4 F joined the family last month. Now a message has come that the company is preparing to present the new generation of Reno smartphones, Oppo Reno5. Information about an unknown Oppo smartphone has appeared in the Tina database and the, inside, and the insider digital chat station shared some information about it. It is assumed that we are talking about the upcoming Oppo Reno5. Among the distinctive features of the new smartphone is a 4000 200mAh battery with fast 65W charging and a multi-module main camera with 64MP main sensor, 8MP ultra-wide sensor, a 2MP telephoto sensor and a 2MP depth sensor. It is also important to note that the smartphone will run Android 11 with Color OS user interface. Its front panel will be a 6.43 inch OLED display with a refresh rate of 60Hz as a hardware platform. The device will receive the Dimensity 800U chip with a clock frequency of 2.4 GHz and support for 5G. When to wait for the announcement of Oppo Reno5, it is not known for certain. We can only speculate that the company will not postpone the release of the smartphone and will present it before the end of this year. In the 5G era, smartphone processors are becoming more and more important. Now most China-based first-tier manufacturers rely on Qualcomm's and MediaTek's 5G processor. But this situation will soon change. It turns out that Xiaomi will begin using Samsung's Exynos processor next year. Moreover, besides Xiaomi, other Chinese brands such as Oppo and Vivo will also use Exynos chips in their smartphones. Since last year, Vivo has become the first company to cooperate with Samsung and launch the China market custom 5G processor. The first product came with the Exynos 980. If you guess, we are talking about the Vivo G1 5G handset. In this regard, on November 12, Samsung will unleash the next generation flagship Exynos 1080 processor. The Exynos 1080 processor is based on a 5 nanometer processor and uses 4 Cortex A78 large cores and 4 Cortex A55 small cores. The GPU is Mali G78. This is the world's first 5 nanometer A78 flagship chip. In terms of performance, the current benchmark data of Antutu is 693,600 points. The CPU score is 181,000 points. As you can see, the performance of the Exynos 1080 has surpassed the Snapdragon 865 and the Snapdragon 865 Plus. Moreover, it is slightly lower than that of the Kirin 9000 processor. The overall performance is very powerful. According to the latest news, Samsung's LSI division plans to supply Exynos processor to companies such as Xiaomi, Oppo and Vivo in 2021. The report did not give specific models, but the Exynos 1080 or even higher end Exynos 2100 have all chances to appear on these Chinese brands models. This simply means that in next year's 5G processor market, Qualcomm and MediaTek will have greater pressure. So what do you guys think about this video? Let me know down in the comment section and as always, I will see you in the next video. Till then, subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so you never miss any video from my channel. Thank you.